Veeam is a global leader in data management and protection solutions, specializing in backup, recovery, and data availability for businesses of all sizes. Their innovative technologies ensure the security and resilience of critical data, mitigating risks such as ransomware threats and data loss. To talk more about this, I am joined now by the Chief Technical Officer, Danny Allen, all the way from Boston. Thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you, Trinity. Delighted to be here with you. Now, Veeam is currently a provider of data protection and ransomware protection. Tell me more, why do you think Veeam is a leader amongst its competitors and what has become so hot in this industry? Well, my belief is that Veeam has become a leader for three reasons, really. One is the technology innovation. We're always on the cutting forefront of emerging technologies like Kubernetes or cloud or SaaS services like Microsoft 365 and Salesforce. We also are very obsessed on the customer outcomes. And so we have a customer obsession, making sure that we're reacting to what their needs are. And lastly, everyone talks about protecting data. We actually talk a lot about recovering data because of course, to a customer, the most important thing is not just having a copy of your data, but being able to recover it quickly when you have a threat facing you like ransomware. And how do you perceive today's threat landscape, particularly with ransomware attacks on enterprises? What challenges do cybersecurity leaders face? Well, certainly things are getting worse, I'll say. Ransomware is becoming far more prevalent, and I know this because we did a study actually in 2021 about how many times organizations were hit by ransomware, and 76% of those organizations had been hit by ransomware. Last year we did this to over 4,000 organizations, same question, and it was 85% of them had been hit by ransomware. And so certainly the threat landscape is becoming more prevalent. Also, I would say, you know, I'm working at home right now, and a lot of organizations have this work from home strategy, and so the surface, the attack surface that you're trying to protect is becoming more fragmented and more difficult for a lot of the cybersecurity leaders. Now, do you think that we are losing the war on ransomware, and how can businesses make sure that their data is actually safe? I do believe that we're currently losing the war on ransomware. Um, and just malware in general. And I always tell the leaders that I, I meet with that really we need to focus on two things. The first line of defense, which is educating our, our employees, educating our customers, educating the users on what best practices are. But secondly, focus on the last line of defense. If you want to protect your data, you need to make sure that you have a copy of that data in a secure location, and not only a copy of the data, but that you can recover it quickly if you get hit by a cyber threat. Can you tell me what companies are doing wrong when it comes to cybersecurity and data protection? Well, in general, Trinity, I think that the big thing is that we're reactive to the problem. In other words, we get hit by ransomware and we think, oh no, it's happened, you know, we need to address this. And in fact, in that study, 85% had been hit by or had been attacked by ransomware. We did a study of 1,200 organizations that had been impacted by ransomware. And the interesting thing was that two thirds of them that had been hit more than once. That tells me that we're not being proactive. And so I always tell organizations, just focus on the security fundamentals, Fo focus on the best practices. We need to learn uh, from the lessons of the past in order to prevent them in the future. Great, thank you so much. That's a lot of important information, Danny. I appreciate you joining me today. Thank you, Trinity.